So I'm watching you in the game uh, last week. You make this fantastic play. Lance throws over the middle. Pass is caught. Flag is thrown. There goes Goddard. When you scored, and I thought it was a score, when you turn around and you see the flag, what were you thinking? Um, initially, um, you know, I'm, I put my hands up, uh, telling the ref that I was in and everything. And uh, he just, he's just kind of looking at me. Then I look back and I see the flag. I'm like, man. Like that was a long ways to run. I'm like, it must be holding or something. I'm like, maybe they'll talk about it. Maybe it was on the defense or something. And then when they called on me, I was pretty surprised. But uh, it happens. How big is it for you that your position coach played in the National Football League, the same position? He played tight end, Justin Peel. Set it. Break. One more time. Bring your hips through contact, bud. One more time. Same grip. One more time. Bring your hips through contact. Set it. Break. That's better and you've got one of the premier pass catchers at your position in the same room. How, how much has that helped you? Yeah, it, it's helped a lot. He knows where we're coming from. He knows the uh, struggles of being a tight end or, you yep. know, the easy parts of it, the hard parts of it, how our bodies are feeling. And, you know, just the knowledge he brings to the room is, uh, is, has been great for me. And the same thing with Zach. Um, obviously, just kind of watching the way he goes about his day, day by day. Um, that just kind of taught me how to be a true professional. It is complete. Down to the five, breaking the tackle, in for the touchdown. It is Goddard, Dallas Goddard. When did it start to slow down for you, or that adjustment you were able to make as a National Football League player? Um, I think it happened uh, pretty quick into the year. The more times you see defenses, the more time you see coverages, the easier it gets for me. So uh, I feel like the more I'm on the field, the more I'll grow. So keep doing what you're doing, and even the name Dallas will not affect you in Philadelphia. <laughs> Appreciate it. Right. Appreciate it.